Hi, I'm Miss Jean, and thanks for joining us for one of our short segments here on Discovery Mountain. You know, in Discovery Mountain, every day is an exercise in faith. And today, let me tell you about the faith exercise involved in creating this program. God answered our prayers even before we asked. Discovery Mountain began as an idea, an idea to minister to kids and families about Jesus. You know, my daughters loved listening to audio stories when they were young, and I realized something. They still liked listening even as they got older. And when my husband Sean and I began working for the ministry that brings you Discovery Mountain, ministry called The Voice of Prophecy, God put an idea on my heart. You see, The Voice of Prophecy began as a radio program, oh, all the way back in 1929. And you know, audio is still one of the best ways to listen to stories, and so, I began dreaming of creating a program, a program just like Discovery Mountain. There were several faith exercises involved in this process. First, we built a studio in our Loveland, Colorado location. And here's a fun insider secret. This studio project was led by Ruben Gomez, who is our media director and, yes, the voice of Jake Donovan. Well, after the studio was built, we began planning this program, Discovery Mountain. And our goal was, and still is, to create engaging episodes that kids from any background would enjoy listening to and that would help them to get to know Jesus better. And there were a few important pieces that we had to figure out along the way. Well, first we needed a director. And after searching high and low, we decided to get in touch with Doug Bruce. Now, Doug had been a TV director and a producer for years. We'd worked with him on projects in the past. And so we asked if he would consider working on an audio program. Well, much to our surprise and delight, Doug agreed. And with the help of sound engineer Danny Columbi, we had our team. Now, I had all kinds of ideas for characters and stories, but I still didn't know where the setting should be for all of these stories. Should the setting for the stories be a school or a church or or maybe somewhere else? I just wasn't sure. Well, early fall a couple of years ago, I was camping with my family in the Colorado mountains. It was late and for some reason, everyone else was asleep, but I was wide awake. And as I stared up at the ceiling of the tent, an idea came to me. The setting for this new program would be a small town in the mountains, a small town with a summer camp at the heart of it. And the name, Discovery Mountain, well, that was easy after that decision. Now, of course, there were a few more big decisions to make after that. Where would we find voice actors? Director Doug and I recruited George Swanson to play Mr. Simon. We already knew that he had a great voice. We auditioned and filled several roles, and there was just one important character left to cast. I prayed about who we would cast for the part of Jake Donovan. You see, as the program's main character, we needed just the right person with just the right voice. Well, I was working on another project for The Voice of Prophecy, and I needed a couple of people to play Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego, you know, Daniel's three friends that were thrown into the fiery furnace. Well, Ruben Gomez was one of the staff members who agreed to play that role for the video. When the video played at an event a few weeks later, I heard God's answer to my prayer. You see, Reuben had the perfect voice for Jake Donovan. I don't know why I'd missed that before. But after much prayer, Reuben accepted the role. And God had the right voice for Jake right here, right under my nose the entire time I was praying about it. God is so good that way. Well, that's the short version of our faith exercise in getting this program started. God answered our prayers before we even finished asking them, just like He tells us He will in Isaiah chapter 65 and verse 24. That verse says this, It shall come to pass that before they call, I will answer, and while they are still speaking, I will hear. Well, we just 
finished season four of Discovery Mountain, and we hope that you enjoyed listening as much as we enjoyed producing it for you. There's a brand new season coming on March 28, 2018. Season five is called Family Matters, and you won't want to miss it. You'll hear all of your favorite characters like Jake Donovan, Mr. Simon, Jamie, Gadget, Kayla, Wyatt, and more. So join us again next week for another Discovery Mountain short segment where I'll give you a sneak peek and maybe even a sneak listen to season five. Remember, that all new season begins on March 28th. Well, thanks for listening, and don't forget to keep exercising your faith. While you're waiting for the new season, be sure to visit us on our website, discoverymountain.com, where you can watch video bloopers. They are a ton of fun to watch, and you can watch other behind-the-scenes footage. You'll find these and more in the Director Doug area of the homepage. So just scroll down past where you listen to the episodes, and you'll find it all right there. And be sure to visit the Discover area of the site, too. There you'll find caricatures of your favorite characters. And don't forget to follow us on social media. We're on Instagram, we're on Twitter, we're on Facebook, and there you'll find exclusive content and updates. Well, until next time, I'm Miss Jean, and this has been a Discovery Mountain short segment. Join us again next week.